Welcome to the CSIR's Additive Manufacturing Facilities. Additive manufacturing, or three-dimensional printing, is the process of making a physical object from a digital file, building an item layer by layer. It is a technology that is driving the fourth industrial revolution, in which the boundaries of the physical, digital, and biological worlds are blurring as a result of advances in different technologies. Research and development into high-speed, large area additive manufacturing takes place at the CSIR's additive manufacturing facilities. 3D printing has come to play a unique role in many industries. It is the technology of choice for the production of parts that are too complex to produce through conventional means, or would be too expensive to produce. The CSIR, originally in partnership with Aerosuit, started the Aeroswift project to fill the need for faster printing and the production of larger parts, especially for the aerospace industry where such a capability is of great value. This machine has a scalable build volume of up to 2000 by 600 by 600 cubic millimeters, allowing for the mass production of larger parts. Aeroswift is based on the processes of selective laser melting, in which an object is produced from metal powder which is deposited in layers and fused by a high-power laser. Some of the latest work consists of implementing a movable extraction system, which allows for expanding the build volume and even higher power process development. The CSIR has also expanded on its design for additive manufacturing capabilities to add to the value chain and can assist people in industry to modify or design parts suitable for printing. Some examples of products produced using Aeroswift technology include brackets used in the aerospace industry, impellers, turbo rotors, parts for high-end cars and topology-optimized parts. The CSIR established a proof-of-concept facility at the CSIR to operate alongside Aeroswift. It is a much smaller machine but can handle the same process parameters. It is capable of the same build rate, but on a smaller scale. However, with its build volume of 415 mm diameter and more than 220 mm deep, it is still large for a machine of this type. The uptake of additive manufacturing happened quite rapidly. Companies also realized that there are technologies that could not only produce new parts faster and cheaper, but that could also be used for the refurbishment of existing industrial components. This is a critical service in sectors where parts have to be imported or where high value parts are used and replacement is costly. The CSIR invested in a laser engineered net shaping facility through which existing parts can be refurbished or custom parts can be created much faster and at much more competitive costs than traditional replacement or manufacture. The laser-engineered net shaping technology, called Lens Technology, focuses on blown powder laser metals deposition additive manufacturing. In the additive manufacturing industry, factors such as time and investment, the dangers of downtimes, and the challenge of competition, all influence the competitiveness of companies and ultimately the competitiveness of the country. Thank <laughs> you.